I do like that. Leon Cash, age nine, you did a very good job. WTVR has always shown a special caring for the children of Central Virginia. You can make your daughter's day her tomorrow bright. But in 1987, a dedicated and concerned group of people here decided we could do more. The For Kids Sake program gave top priority to children's issues. News Channel 6 began by airing public service announcements. And as the program grew over more than a decade, we set up scholarships. We worked in partnership with the community to make the lives of families and children better. No, for, kids sake. for kids' sake, we chose outstanding young people as ambassadors to work in our neighborhoods. Took that same experience Some of them built careers on these early experiences. George Daniels, for example, went on to produce television news in Atlanta. I learned the skills that I'm using as a producer as a For Kids' Sake ambassador. Welcome to the premiere show of For Kids Sake. Jeff Quillian hosted our first For Kids Sake show. Eleven years later, he's a new dad and a News Channel 6 videographer. Well, For Kids Sake gave me an opportunity to get involved in television since that's what I wanted to do. Uh, I was a senior in high school when I got involved in For Kids Sake. And, um, and I used For Kids Sake as an avenue to get into television and uh, met a lot of people. And when I finished with college, I uh, renewed those contacts and it helped me get my first internship, which got me my first job at Channel 6. Through news stories, specials, scholarships, and more, For Kids Sake is leaving an important mark on the region. With community partners, we've built more than a dozen tot lots, ensuring there are safe places for children to play. Good evening, everyone. I'm Lisa Cooley. In our For Kids Sake program tonight, we'll meet six exceptional kids from throughout Central Virginia. They're young men and women who care about their community and are doing something about it. One of the pioneers of For Kids Sake was single-minded in her conviction that every child deserves the most love and the brightest opportunities that we can give. Her name was Norma Jean Blaylock, and her memory lives here in the echo of children's laughter on this tot lot in South Richmond. This playground was dedicated in 1996 as the Norma Blaylock Tot Lot. I don't have any kids and suddenly one morning I had about 41. Norma left us too soon in 1995 when she was just 40 years old. But her For Kids Sake hopes live. For some, the name For Kids Sake is synonymous with News Channel 6. It is one of our finest contributions and proudest accomplishments.